Well, if this next story proves one thing, it is that music is so much more than just something we all listen to. For local refugee children, it's become a way to help them call Western New York home. Here's two on your sides, Leanne Stuck. That's the sound of hope and belonging for refugee children living in Buffalo. The nonprofit Buffalo String Works teaches children to play string instruments to build community. They do have some music programs in their school, but they don't have string instrument instruction. The founders of the charity saw the need five years ago. So now, three days a week, they provide students with instruments and free lessons. A lot of our kids come from Myanmar. That's sort of like the majority uh, that we have right now. Um, but they're also from Thailand, from Somalia. We've had Syrian students and Afghanistan. Um, we really have students from all over the globe. When I see they, were, they are playing music, I know that I'm very pleased. Helen Ka came to America through a refugee program in Burma. Both of her children play the violin. Very happy because uh, before they don't know about music, they don't know nothing. And, uh, <clears throat> and when I was young, I want to learn uh, music but I don't have uh, opportunity. And music is definitely a universal language. Um, so kids who speak very good English and kids who speak less good English, they can still communicate through music. So there's 17 students in the first class in 2014. And since then we've grown to, now we have 85 students. And it continues to grow, opening the minds and hearts of refugee children searching for a sense of belonging in Western New York. To make particularly our community members from other parts of the world feel welcome and feel like they have a new home here in Buffalo. Leanne Stock, Channel 2 News.